Okay, the importance of sleep. So why is sleep so important? When we sleep, we repair. It's that simple, okay? So I, our growth hormone secretes more, our testosterone does, and our body goes into a repair state. So if you're someone that has terrible sleep deprivation, it means your residual activation system is not shutting off, which means you're sleeping with one eye open, which is where you're a little bit wired from the day, okay? That means your penile gland that sits right in the middle of your head behind your eyes can't release any melatonin, which is our sleep chemical. Serotonin is our wake chemical, melatonin is our sleep chemical. Anyhow, you won't release much of it, or you're dipping in and out of sleep. So you don't repair, okay? So how do we solve this? Little things such as like carb before bed are important, or good way of solving it. Now, there's other things we can do as well to lower stress hormones, which is your fright and flight, your residual activation system, which is all wired, where you just can't stop thinking about stuff. But carbs lower your cortisol levels and your stress hormone. So this part of your brain up here can then calm down a little bit. So it helps your penile gland release some melatonin that will push you into sleep. Okay, it's other stuff like abacinamine, meal with turmeric and black pepper and a little bit runny honey, that helps as well. Vitamin C, that lowers cortisol levels, so none of them are calorific. So the carbohydrate white base is, which means it's got calories in it, high saying calories, but it's not the case. If you're not gonna sleep very well, you've got no hope losing weight, no hope growing muscle, no hope feeling good, no hope doing anything good in the following day. So sleep's super important. So if you've got sleep deprivation, okay, there are several ways of fixing it, but the first way we should be thinking about it's actually training, using our mechanics, actually using our body properly, not just stressing it out all the time, but stressing it out in a good way, in terms of like raising our endorphins whilst we're training, and putting good nutrition there. Once they're in place, generally you'll find your sleep deprivation will start to wane. And when it doesn't, or if it doesn't, or not to its fullest, we can put a couple of other things in there and suddenly you start sleeping again. Sleep's super important. I can't stress that enough. Otherwise, if it wasn't, why do we do it? <laughs> Okay, there you go. So those, one last thing, you might have heard some of sleep, to, I'll sleep when I'm dead and things like that. Yeah, you'll die early if you don't sleep enough. I can guarantee that. I can guarantee that. Okay, we'll shorten your lifespan like crazy. And Niles Fox used to say stuff like, I just sleep for free. I can't do his accent. I sleep for three hours a night and the rest of the time I'm working out. He had a heart attack and stuff, okay. Your body needs to rest. It does, okay. It needs to be challenged. It needs to be stressed out at certain points, but it also needs to rest. It's that simple. And that's when we go to bed. So if you're not sleeping properly, get in touch and we'll sort it out. That's for sure. <laughs>